Alright, sorry about that. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, oh, wow. Honey, let's get back. Is that a good thing or a bad thing or a, Dad, or a good thing, Dad, bad thing? Come on, let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on, don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. I don't know about this now, all of a sudden. All of the sudden. Screw! Meow! Alright. Oh, do I really gotta do this for every single one of them? Oh my god, this is gonna take forever. So, uh, what's up? How's you guys' day going? Um, I'm doing pretty good. Pretty good. My day, um... We were, like, gonna go down to the beach house for the weekend. And then an hour in driving, we decided to turn around. So then we had to drive an hour home. And now I'm home again, so it's like, okay then. <gasps> he has the same look on his face, like, okay then. Whoa. Uh. Hmm. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Uh. What? What the? What the? Got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. That's the sketchiest answer I've heard in a long time, and I have to deal with a lot of crap. <laughs> Falcon punch! Okay, or, or are you just not gonna... I was gonna punch him. That's what I would've done. I would've just, like, knocked him out stone cold. And then went to the house. But maybe I'm a bit overkill. Or maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm just diabolical. But maybe... I'm the hero that Gotham deserves, but not the one it needs. Maybe diabolical is what we need. Excuse a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. Now go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mom? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. I don't think he'd be that screwed up to the air. I mean, he was able to run away. He, he ought to be fine by now, right? I mean, I'm surely that's just common sense. Hmm. Go to the bathroom, right? Wait, wait. I saw college diploma. And his baseball trophy. Hmm. Seems like it's been years since kids were playing sports for fun. And his college degree. These boys aren't stupid. High school diploma. Oh, uh, let's go wash our hands, I guess. Let's uh, or, or see what there is here. Nah, I, you look rugged, and that's always cool. Some kind of lotion. All right, all right, all right, all right. Shh, covered ups, covered ups, covered ups, covered ups, covered ups. Come on, come on. Covert ops, covert ops, covert ops, covert ops, covert ops, go! Oh, that wasn't covert. That wasn't covert at all. Mission abort, mission abort, ghost recon, just full on guns blazing, run, run! Or you can just keep being stealth. Alright, whatever, I mean, I guess that worked. Bedroom door. This is where Mark should be, right? Mark, but Brenda said he was up here resting. Exactly. A bookshelf. Home books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. Hmm. I don't know what to think about this. Closet door. Maybe Mark's in the closet. Or not. Morphine? <laughs> morphine? Musty as hell. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. Why do they need what so do much? Need with this kind of stuff? Exactly. The intrigue, the mystery, the power cord. 
to what? What could it be to? I don't even know. I don't even. What the hell? There's a light. That was the best. That was the bedroom. That was. That's on the other side. <gasps> Diabolical. Let's go. Let's go. I turned on a light. Behind the bookshelf. There's always secrets behind the bookshelves. Why does anybody even surprise by bookshelves anymore? Pull all of the books out. One of them will open a door or push it out of the way. That is like numero uno on the evil hidden base shenanigans. Oh, <gasps> he's dead! What? Why would they? Oh, okay, he's not dead. He just doesn't have a leg. Um. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Eat dinner. Lee, did you fall in? <laughs> Dinner's on the table and everyone's having a oh, heck. Did y'all get barbecue meat? Oh heck nah. Go to Clementine. Covert ops. Actually, not really. Straight up sprint. Sprint. Sprint for the win. Uh... Don't eat, Don't eat that! Don't do it! Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? <laughs> oh. Sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee. What's gotten into you? He just had a star. He could use some goddamn manners. You are oh, eating anything? human Beats. meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Oh, I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Yeah, screw you too. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. That's a very good point. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> yo, I guess it's gotta be this way. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down. He wouldn't have died. He had an arrow in his shoulder. That's fine. That'll buff out. You're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boss. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Oh, yeah, guess what? Who? <laughs> that's right. That's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Well, then you should eat yourselves, because you're gonna die. <gasps> no, no, that's not what I was implying. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Somebody do something. Lee? Lee? Oh, he did not. No, no, you mother lover. Put her down. <laughs> I'll kill you. Okay. It's true, though. Oh. Um. Wait a second. Oh, God. Oh god, I heard the the stairs, the squeaky stair. <laughs> Who went upstairs? Please. Or who's coming downstairs? Oh god. Really now. Oh. Ah <gasps> oh, heck nah. <laughs> He's going off, okay. Oh, she just puked up people. Just puked up people. It was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I said that. 
rest of us did, god damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet You're the one who made fun of me like <laughs> Oh it ain't people, don't worry about it. You okay, Clementine? You okay, Clem? They didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Oh, oh that's me. good at least. Psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker. We gotta get the fuck out of here. This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. We're gonna come up clutch right here. Um. Pallets. Could there be a hole behind these pallets? You you know friggin' stupid that is. You know how stupid you are for thinking that. Oh, okay. I know. We're gonna get out of here and find them. Come on, try us out. Sam and air conditioner. I'll, I'll break that damn door. Dad, you can't we didn't even examine it. Easy. Oh, is he having another one of his bull craps? That's just great. That's the perfect timing. That is the optimal timing for this crap. No. Great. He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead, he's not dead. Oh wait. Oh. Oh crap. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel. How fast he turned. What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off. Ah uh, no. He's a douche, but I don't want him to be dead. He, 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 we can't kill him if he's not dead. He's not dead, Kenny. Remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bit, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. That's a good point. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But yeah, but it didn't matter Duck then. This guy's not gonna make it. Now it does. Remember what Ben said. You gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. Can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee! I need you. Please help me. Oh man. Come on. Oh come on. Wake up. Okay. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna help. No, no, I don't think so. God, as much as I hate this guy, it's better if we have him alive than if we have him as dead. Oh no, he. Oh God! Don't do it, Kenny. He's gonna turn. What? You're putting all of us at risk, you son of Three. a bitch. You're fucking worthless, Lee. <gasps> oh my! Holy! <laughs> Is that even legal? What the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just it had to be done. You don't know that. Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. And now she has her father all over her. Think about how screwed that is. Screwed up. Are you okay? Is it over? <laughs> yes, for now. Oh man, that was that was oh that's oh ah oh, Because oh. I mean I hate the guy. And I'd be okay with it, killing him, but that's not the right choice. If we could have him alive, if we could have had him alive, that would have been better. If I'd known he wouldn't have died anyway, I would have. I would have helped Kenny, but crap. The air conditioner. Ah, gosh dang it, Kenny. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we've got to have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. I mean, yeah, seriously, could you kill Katja or Duck? But could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Duck? It's never going to come to that, if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have... No, they, they need Katja, remember? She's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. 
Kenny, I'm on your side with everything else but this, man. This is just... If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. Now that's kind of a good point. I, I guess I have to agree with that. You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and lead me to rot. What I want isn't important. What I know is there's safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. Yeah, yeah let's see what Lily's up to. I'm still lively. I'm still alive. Kenny, he made a bad call. It was premature for sure, but he was trying to keep us safe. Yeah, I mean, I can understand why he did it. Just he doesn't give a shit about you and me. He puts his family first, sure, just like Larry did. Yeah, see, exactly. That's the only reason Larry was a dick was because he was caring for his family. The only reason Kenny's a dick is because he was taking care of his family. Isn't that just like? Common sense. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. That'd just be too fortunate. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi tool. Where's that multi tool? Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. That's so helpful. Do, the trick. Do you have a coin? Yeah. Huh, oh, let's see if Oh wait, oh God no Oh god. But if we're gonna get out of here. I remember I remember the big thing. He said he had money on him and stuff. Yeah, the money in his pocket. Ah. Uh. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but back at the motor inn, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. Yup, right at the very beginning. Is my blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. Do what you have to do. Oh god, this is so... Ah. Uh. Oh boy. Idea which pocket he keeps his change in. Kept his change in. Uh, oh, but nope, it's not gonna be that one. Well, it's only the pants pockets, no shirt pockets, really. My mother's. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. I would have, I would have handed it to her. Man, this is uh, this is the weirdest thing. She's like mad at me, even though I tried to help. I mean, that's like, come on, I can't do anything right. Oh, I meant to use the coin, but whatever you say, game. You know. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. God, shut up, Kenny. I'm trying. Can you not see me? See me roll in these streets. There we go. And we got it off. Aren't we just swag? It's too small to fit through. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. Yeah, because I didn't want to volunteer her. That'd just be rude. I know you're brave enough. Yeah, after all she has dealt with. Remember the tree house. She better be brave enough. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I actually she did. Okay. Clementine is clearly the hero that Gotham deserves. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Man, that is 
Ah, uh, ah, uh, my, all of this just. Is it working? It maybe there's standing guard outside there. If she screams, I swear to God, I swear to God. She probably saw all the blood. Yeah, that would shock me. You've had a quite like quite a few minutes. I mean, come on. Okay. Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Gosh, Kenny, why are you being so drastic, bro? You can't save your family if you're dead. That would make it much harder. There are many disadvantages to dying. <laughs> this looks like Dexter's laboratory. Ah, see what I did there? Ha, <laughs> that was a good one. Oh, that's never good, you know.